Hey man, it's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest 2K player in existence. I'm finna show y'all a LeBron build. After season two release with them new SIGs, bro, you can really go crazy. You could be 6'7", max wingspan, you know, and go crazy and still D-Rose and speed glitch as a 6'7". It's supposed to be a moment. This supposed to be your moment This supposed to be your moment What good is being the one when you the only one that knows it Y'all gonna see how I make them You gonna see how devious this build really is I'm gonna go into depth What you need exactly All that other shit You know who you need to be playing with To really maximize the potential of this build Make sure y'all watch this full video So you deeply understand it This is an excellent rebirth build I believe so yeah man so first and before we get into it make sure you subscribe hit the like button it help the algorithm and drop a comment below it helps the algorithm y'all let me know what, which, what else y'all want to see so first we're going to make him a shooting guard okay left right handed do what you want man number 24 for my nigga kobe now look we are going to go with this. Where's this pie chart? Where's the pie chart? We'll go with this pie chart right here, man. Okay. I'm going to explain to you why. We're going to go with the speed pie chart. Okay. Peep it out. Peep it out. Oh. 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 We're going to take this. Ah, ah. Six finishing badges. Very miraculous. Especially for the height and the wingspan that you're going to have. We are going to give him 10 shooting badges. I know it's kind of low. You can't completely beat LeBron, but you're still going to be able to bang out. Just make sure you run with someone with floor general. You probably won't even need it, but make sure you run with someone that can max out floor general, and that'll help you really be unstoppable. Like, And then like throughout the seasons, you can keep adding badge points to players. So you keep building this nigga with extra badge points, Niggas, niggas, niggas gonna be a super god, you know? If you were to ISO with a two-way slash and playmaker, your skill level do have to be a certain level, or you could just spot up with this build. It's the perfect one to two or three build, bro. Like, it could literally play every position, bro. Pro-am, all that, bro, you know? And you could ISO at the top of the key. Y'all know how them two-way slash and playmakers be. But look. You can zigzag with this nigga. Y'all gotta watch my video that I posted yesterday. You can literally D row speed glitch. I broke the game 6'5 through 6'10. You can speed glitch with them niggas. Now, after they release some new SIGs, man. Okay? That's your defensive. So you're gonna have Hall of Fame playmaking. You're gonna be fast as hell, bro. You can speed glitch at 6'7. That means you're gonna be moving faster than them little niggas because your animations is bigger, bro. Okay? To really understand what I'm talking about, you got to watch the dribble tutorial that I just posted, how to speed glitch on the 6.5 through 6.10. And yeah, man, this this is what he looking like, man. Real, real devious, man. Like, like stupid God. You're going to make him burly to appear even bigger than 6.7, right? You're going to make this nigga 6.7. 6.7 demigod, okay? You're going to bring his weight down. Bring his weight down to 188. And here's what we gonna do right here. You gonna max out that damn wingspan, man. So look, after you hit 99, you gonna be able to bring it to a 65-3 and you can bang with that bitch. OD, shooting is very easy in this game. Then if you have someone with floor general, you got a 73. You could bang with that hoe from the top of the key. Hella easy. And then if anything, you can still bang with this in the corner. But look, your ball handle. Once you get 80 ball handle, you can do the D-roll zigzag and shit. All you gotta do is watch my last video to understand. And But yeah, you would have to grind this build. It'll still be good, but once you 99, you're unstoppable, bro. You know, you can run the one, the two. 
You could duo ball handler, and no one's going to be able to stop you. And you unlock the contact dunks, bro. Like, you're really unstoppable, dog. Here are your takeovers. I personally would choose lock take. It seemed like the best one um, overall for OP. But if you want to have fun, uh, get contact dunks, or play, you know, break niggas' ankles, it's, it's all up to you, man. I'm, I might even personally make this hoe for myself, bro. Oh, wait, hold on. Let, let me show you the speeds. So, look, you see the speeds, right? You're going to be able to get 98 speed. And 96 acceleration, bro. That's crazy. On a big 6-7 demigod. Choose whatever take you want, man. And voila, two-way pass first guard. You know, Clay Thompson, Richard Hamilton, and all them other niggas. Now you have to make him a shooting guard to uh to get rim protector. You know, I know a lot of y'all mess up your builds. Man, you could rock something like this, bro, or this, or. <laughs> this what, what what whatever you think works man i i ain't too sure bro i ain't done a lot of slashing this year you could rock the badges like this i don't know if bronze or silver hot zone hunter is better um you could really adjust it to really see what you like if you miss it in the corner you know th this is for if you run in the one you know if you're gonna be running the one with this nigga you could do something like this or if you're going to spot up, do something like this. And if you're still missing, then take these holes off. You know, max this out. <laughs> max that out. If you're missing in the corner with this, like, you're down bad, bro. It's, it's really not too hard. <laughs> you do something like this for the playmaking if you're running the one with him. You know, of course, it would be different if you're spotting up. Hey man, he he intimidating God, bro. You know, you you run this lineup right here. You you know these these three purple badges. It seem like these definitely like man might, might be a must. Like you could really make niggas niggas miss. Like Max Intimidator and Menace, and you gonna have all that speed, bro, and be big as hell. Come on, nigga. You you might be able to stop that that zigzag that y'all niggas hate so much. But um. These seem good to guard ball and, you know, guard the bigs too a little bit. You know, you can really guard everybody with this lineup. You might want to take this off if you ain't really getting plucks with it. But, I mean, it's worth testing out. And I I, I, th I think this is cool, bro. I, I, I really do, man. I really do. You might want to take off ball stripper, put on a pause on interceptor or hustler or chase down you can really go crazy man y'all rate the build down below y'all let me know what type of play style you want to play and um i'll drop some more builds for y'all on current or next gen just let a nigga know and i'll give you the brilliant insight of the swan the chosen one anywho man make sure y'all subscribe if you know hit that like button it helps the algorithm comment down below anything it helps the algorithm turn on post notice Make sure y'all follow me on Twitch, follow me on all my socials, and I'm out this hope, my boy. But hey, hey, here we go again, yeah, here, here we go again, people talking this, but when this hit the fan, everything I'm at made me, now break it down, yo, off the top of the dome, dome.